going into your fifth year, what are your expectations for this season? I expect us to win this year. Um, I, I definitely think that we've built a foundation and we've added the right players to who are currently here. Um, and I think that we've got a lot of stuff that it's, it's time to put some, some wins up. From your preseason practices and some of your scrimmages, what did you see this preseason that you really liked and that you want to take forward into this season? The biggest thing that um, I like the most about this group is that we, we returned a lot of people and not just our captains, but everybody as a whole with the leadership of our style of play and um, what, what we value here within our program. They are very quickly trickling that down to the freshmen and the, the, the clicking together as a unit has come um, a lot more quickly than it has in the past. Talking about your returners a little bit, what do you expect to see out of them and their leadership with the team on the field this season? I expect them to play like they don't have another year left. Um, specifically the seniors. They've, they've been here for a long time, I imagine they feel. And I think that they're on the same page as I am and our assistant Colin that I know they want to win. And I expect them to use that uh, to fuel their leadership um, for the freshmen. And touching a little bit on those freshmen and your newcomers this season, what do they bring to the table that's a little bit different and how have you used that and blended that in with your returners? Well, with the newcomers, we brought in a couple strong goal scorers that just have the natural ability to just put the ball in the back of the net. It's kind of, it's what they're great at. Um, and I expect them to add on to our returners um, to kind of show them also how to do that because we definitely have some people that can score. Overall, what are the keys to success for this season of bringing those wins to Francis Marion and the program? We're very big on positivity. Um, just because there's a lot of things that can go on outside of our control and we want to stay focused on just us this year. We don't want to worry about um, any of the naysayers. We don't want to worry about anybody else, what they are doing. We want to solely focus on us. And I think that if we focus on our positivity, our effort, our discipline and our intensity, we'll be good to go this year. Coach, do you have any key players to watch this season? Anyone we should be looking out for? if anyone stands out at all, if not the team as a whole? Well, we've got some, we've got some girls that stand out and I don't want to give that away yet, but we, d we definitely have, um, we've got a lot of girls that have been, that have been here and it's really fun to see how, um, how they've improved as soccer players. And that's pretty special. Um, I think Sierra Cartano has done an absolutely fantastic job from where she was as a freshman to who she is now. Um, Jessica Garnett, she's amazing. She's always been one of our raw athletes and she's someone that you can always count on. Um, Carly Gautier, she that kid just wants to play. She just wants to score and she just wants to win. Um, so we're excited about her. And then of course, Michaela Kitchen, she's our other senior. So we're, we're really pumped about all of them. Kitchen's determination leads them all. Coach, thank you very much. We look forward to seeing you as you guys open up your season here on Saturday uh, at Hartzler, Hartzler Field against Leagues McRae at 1 p.m. Yes, thank you so much.